Now, preparations for the interdenominational memorial service for the 21 victims of the Hillside and Russia Academy fire tragedy are underway. The memorial will be held Thursday at Mwege Stadium. We now link up with our reporter JJ uh, Kyoria, who's currently at the Mwege Stadium, where preparations are underway to give us an update of what's currently happening. Thank you, Jackie Wambiru, back at Broadcasting House. We're coming live to you from Amwega Stadium. Final touches are being done here, and this will be the venue of the uh, memorial service for the 21 children who perished at the Hillside and Russia Academy. Initially, that service was supposed to be conducted today, but then again, to accommodate other um, uh, interests, of course, it was pushed uh, to tomorrow. But I'll just show you what is happening here on the ground, uh, probably before um, I tell you what else is happening. That is where the dais will be um, and I'm assuming that's where the priests will be uh, and dignitaries will be somewhere around here um, in terms of you know as they gather together to mourn the death of the 21 children who died in the fire incident what you're seeing there that's a meeting that is ongoing uh, between the county uh, governor uh, governor Mutahi Kahiga and the security team in Nyeri um, of course the final preparations as the program uh, takes shape in terms of how it will look tomorrow uh, that's a meeting ongoing uh, bringing together this county security team and the governor Mutahi Kahiga. On the other side, that's where members of the public will be seated and you can see final touches really being um, done there in terms of the arrangement of seats as well as um, uh, even the installation of a sound system uh, to ensure that everything is in shape and in good place, um, of course, as uh, the country prepares to mourn tomorrow uh, the uh, death of the 21 children who died in the fire incident. A horrific scene uh, that was about two weeks ago when a fire broke out and burnt uh, the boys' dormitory and 21 children died from it. Uh, this exercise was supposed to be, or rather, initially uh, the matching of DNA for parents and the children were supposed to take a month but then again um, the government was able to uh, introduce experts that were really able to match the DNA of children and their parents within two weeks and that process has already completed so from tomorrow the memorial service and then the interment of the remains of uh, those children uh, scheduled for different dates but within uh, Nyeri County um, and particularly in Kenya West where most of the children or the cracks of uh, the, uh, the number of uh, most of a number of children uh, were coming from that is Kenya West of Nyeri uh, county uh, the service is tomorrow and we'll be giving you more details in our subsequent bulletins but for now let me hand you back to jackie wambiru at broadcasting house